The following segment is sponsored by Wave Armor. Hey guys, it's Alexa Score from the CW Crew. I am joined today by Rick Johannick from Wave Armor. Welcome to uh, our beachside interview. Thank you. Yeah. It's nice to be here. And you are, we're in Buffalo, Minnesota right now. You're a local here, but you run this amazing company called Wave Armor. Tell me a little bit briefly about what Wave Armor is. Well, I started it 10 years ago because I'd seen what was on the market and everybody at that time was building something just good enough to change how people had done it. But they didn't change and they didn't, they didn't uh, improve over the years. They kept the same thing. So I seen that and I felt that was a great niche to get into and start improving it. It was a great idea. I took it to the next level. And we just keep thinking, I just, I never stop processing on how we can make this better. And we've really taken the standard dock from going out to the boat, you know, just a walkway to get to the boat to really outside living. And that's where we really, really shine as we've brought it to outside living to where we have, you know, umbrellas and, and patios and furniture out there and have fireplace out there. I did notice all the amazing accessories, but before we get there, this is made out of a different material than most traditional docks. docks. Yeah, most docks are made out of aluminum and or steel, galvanized steel. Ours is plastic. Um, it's got a 20 year life expectancy on it. It's very washable. You can, you can take a dock that's eight to 10 years old, pressure wash it and it'll look like brand new. Um, and it's foam filled, so you just it's very maintenance free. Uh, you put it in, most of the lakes, that you, you can leave in, let it freeze in, most in, in most conditions, not all conditions. Which is super unique for Minnesota, because typically so. we're pulling docks out at the end of the summer, putting them in in spring, and it, it actually is a lot of work. Um, but besides that, so it's a floating, right? Yep, floating dock. And which makes it different, and that would also make it easy. You're not having to adjust it, right? If Always, the water goes up, yep. the water goes down. Correct, yep, it, uh, it self adjusts all the time to the water level. So when the water's up two, three feet, um, you, you just you, you can just smile because you don't have to do a whole lot with it. And watch your neighbors. Um, and watch your their neighbors dock. struggle with their docks. <laughs> or the decks coming up. We have a lot of pictures where uh, in the spring of the year, uh, the aluminum docks are losing all the decks that that are on there. The, so they the have sections, a dock yeah. and it gets covered with water, and the water goes down. There's just a frame there with no walkway on it. So. Right. Well, that is so exciting, and we love that it's made in the USA. Of course you know, supporting our community here in Minnesota as well. But I'm gonna go take a step on the dock here eventually because we've been talking about it and sure, I haven't stepped sure. foot out there yet. But thank you so much for joining us. You're it's so well. fun, it's such a fun story. You just keep working hard. I know you're probably coming up with some new product in your head right now. <laughs> um, but Rick joined us from Wave Armor. You heard all about it, but you can find out more at wavearmor.com.